play. Renekton has a lot of agency in the early game, especially against someone like a, uh, a Malphite. Remember that that W can shred through those shields very effectively. And uh, G2 have a lot of early game options. In terms of scaling, I think that BDS do scale a little bit better. Uh, Mickey's been able to make his way up. He's hovering in the fog of war. Observers, we can see what BDS sees right now. They don't have one now, they have information that Mickey is there. Engage the Brob. From the Brob. Nuke looked for the stun as well, they lock him up, the Timbers comes down! And the Brob takes first blood, that flash beam burnt earlier on. Wouldn't be surprised if he just runs there immediately, the wave can no be shoved in pretty quickly. Camps no flash, Nuke has one, flashes forward, there's the Timbers knock up coming out as well with the tidal wave. Trying to answer back, he caps, knocks Shale back into his team, Camps will fall to the Brob. Shale low, down to 200 HP, but he's dashing, he's dodging, he's weaving his way away, and Nikki. Flashes forward, a bloodthirsty army is something we love to see. Twisted advance forward as well. The Bob gets a knock up into Yank. Nuke with a stopwatch, but not really too much mana. And Mickey's looking for two. It's a double for each. The triple for Mickey. It's a fishy fish fish. Kill on Nami. Crowdy. Oh, give it to Mickey, give it to Mickey. Hunt Summer, do you dare steal this kill away? The Cullen finds <laughs> it. And Mickey's Quadra is stolen by his AD carry. <laughs> Han Summer with a great culling is able to convert that into a kill. And G2 will find four flash. I've had enough of this. <laughs> it's for dinner. I yes, they're trying to punish the flash that's caps. Broken Blade has now found Crowny. No sums. No sums, no ultimate, nowhere to go for Crowny. Cold where he stands by Han. LeBrock has three kills as well, but he's building Shirelius, which does give you move speed, does give you a little bit, but doesn't give you as much damage as that man they can do. Flash forward from LeBrock, though, is immediately as I talk about him. He shows just why power on Rakan can be so impactful. Another kill goes down as Hunt Lane. Adam looking for a bit of a flank. G2 starts to disengage. Shale going forward, lands the stun onto Broken Blade. Adam chunked away at by Caps. Broken Blade in the pit. Caps. He kept a bag by Adam LeBrock. Quickness onto the back line. He immediately goes in and Hunt Summer immediately goes down. Broken Day dives in onto Crowny though. And that's two quick kills over G2. Adam trying to do everything he can. Shao trying to dodge away from Cats. Dashes back in with a heartbreaker, but a double over the Yike and Shao, the last man standing. Caught out by Cats. And an ace for G2. BDS getting that initial shot. Sure because they have that slow. LeBrov once again looking for that same flank. TP comes in from Adam, now going to be with the team from the start of the fight. Drake down to 6,000 HP. LeBrov chipped away by Caps, forced away as well, but with the Nature's Grass coming out, the Dragon resetting the tidal wave. Use Crowny in the pit, and Yike will secure the Dragon. Crowny has to flash out. Broken Blade absolutely ripping BDS to shreds. Adam looking for some sort of small consolation prize, but even Mickey will not fall. Only Hans Summer goes down for G2. And now they can look to push in and break open the base of BDS. BDS keep getting kills on the Hans Summer, but he... Uh, eight for Broken Blade. Mickey 13 out of 14 because of the triple kill he got earlier in the game. <laughs> Baron started for G2. Shale looking to steal. Yeah, TP coming in from Nuke as well. No real way for BDS to get around this pit. pit. Shale can, of course, Heartbreaker in, flash out, or do that in reverse. Baron down to three and a half thousand. Yeah, I think it's probably going to ult to try and zone them away. Uh, someone's going to ult with the Cullen. Nuke Shirelli it out. Still 3,000 HP on this. The Sapling's doing quite a lot of work. Broken Blade can dash across the pit. Cat's coming in. And Nuke forced away. No TP on him, remember. There's the ult. Nature's Grasp. Unstoppable force goes in the root. The Heartbreaker! But Broken Blade secures the Baron in the midst of it all. Shao forced away the chase forward from Hans Summer and Caps. And you have to feel this is the icing on the cake for G2. Shao's going to try and dodge away and does manage to escape as G2 realize. Think about it. A an thousand bonus damage. An extra thousand damage. And it's 2,268 for the Nami. I mean, that's pretty impactful. You do have a lot of CC in your kit and slows as the Maokai stun's gonna land here onto Broken Blade. He turns Ooh. back onto Adam and he absolutely melts. All that extra magic damage coming to the four. 4G2, Hansama dashing over the root lands on three. And BDS are routed in their base. A stun as well connects on Crowdy. And only Shao can stand and watch as, BD as G2 wipe away the third inhibitor. Yike on the front line. And he Zaps some magic, pops a stopwatch, it's okay. As G2 start off with winning waves here in summer.